and I told him my thoughts and my vision because right. I wanted his okay. So he said, okay, do what you do. Amen. With that being said, this might sting a little bit. It's going to make you really rich. So what, what I'm going to ask you to do in a minute is bow your head and close your eyes for a little while. But at the same time, I want you to keep them closed no matter how difficult it may sound, what you may hear, do your best to keep your head down and your eyes closed. And I will let you know at the end of it when it's time to bring them up. During that time, what I need you to do is let your mind go. Let it completely go. And let out anything you've been holding in. All the hate, the frustration, mm -hmm. that any irritation and anger that you may have because it has been holding you captive. And it will continue to do so until you let it go. So, yeah. But also, I want you to embrace the spirit. Embrace the moment, embrace the tears, and embrace the pain. Because it is okay not to be okay. Yes. Yes. <laughs> please bow your head, please, and close your eyes. Woo. He taught me how to treat your significant other 
<laughs> and display your love that I have yet to achieve. <laughs> you show me how to balance God and family and provide you with an example of how I must conduct myself as an adult. <laughs> One valuable lesson he taught me is you don't need to have a lot of money to be rich. <laughs> and because of that, I wish I had one more time. <laughs> As a child, you don't realize the effects someone has on you until you're older. Only then was I able to connect the dots. I noticed, although my own man, I done and said many of the same things that he did. And ultimately, our foundation became a reflection of his. What he left us is priceless. Yes. The thoughts, the memories, the life lessons, and the invaluable moments. <clears throat> his story is officially written. His legacy is cemented, and his history is etched in stone. Yes. He has received his ultimate blessing in living in heaven amongst the angels he loved most. <laughs> and putting everything in perspective, it is a blessing yeah. that I don't have one more time. <laughs> <laughs>